Hi guys and welcome back to Try the DIY. So today I am going to be making a $3 fall candle and I got everything from the Dollar Tree. So what you're going to need today are you're going to need the leaves that they sell there and you could do any assorted colors or anything like that, whatever they have. I also got there this glass little candle holder and I got this pumpkin candle from there. Now the other thing that you're going to need um, that's not at the Dollar Tree or if you have it at home you can use it is either Mod Podge and the sponge brush or what I'm just going to use is my hot glue gun that I had here at the house. So I'm going to show you step by step on how to make the fall candle because fall is my favorite season. I'm so excited that it's going to be that time of the year or it already is that time of the year. So I'm going to kind of just go step by step. I'm just going to do a little project to kind of start decorating and getting in the fall spirit. So I'll show you exactly what I do, how I place it, and we'll go from there. All right, so once again, I have my hot glue gun, my glass, my leaves, and my candle. So right now we're just gonna move the candle to the side because we're not gonna focus on that right now. And what we're gonna do is, let me put that right in the center so you can see that. So I am gonna just kinda place the leaves everywhere up on here. So with Mod Podge, it'll obviously be easier because you'll just kind of do the whole surface with that and the sponge, and then you just stick them on there. I don't have any, so I'm just going to use this. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put a line of hot glue across and then just place it pretty much wherever I want. Just be careful because these leaves are thin if you are using hot glue and you don't want to burn yourself just like that and then I'm just gonna kind of mix and match the colors and which directions they're going now there's two ways you can do this you can have them so the leaves are still up or you can glue the leaves down it's all based on preference how you feel and you could always change it too. You could always stick them down after if you don't end up liking the look. And then so just like that. I think I'm going to put another one right here and right here. I think this is a cool little craft to do especially for the time of the year that it is. Because they sell things like this at the store but that's like $10 for the candle holder and you can just make them for three all right so this is the first side that's done I'm leaving some holes in the middle so that way when you're lighting the candle and it goes through it kind of gives the glow outside of the candles so there's the first side and then now I'm gonna just show you all around it's pretty easy took five minutes and this is how it looks very festive very 
folly like I don't know if that's a word now there's one last step and that's putting the candle on so the Dollar Tree candles they come with this cute little I don't know a little rope around it to make it more festive well we don't need that so with that you can just throw it away and then we open up the candle and you could do any flavor you can do any size jar you don't need to do that and then you just plop that bad boy oh my gosh I love the smell of pumpkin in and bada bing bada boom you got yourself a pretty cute looking candle holder so that was it guys thank you so much for watching um if you have done this before and have done it a certain way comment down below if you want to see anything else done comment down below as well and re please remember to like comment and subscribe if you're not subscribed and i'll see you next time bye